The Arizona State women's soccer team struggled to find the back of the net in 2019. However, this season, the story is looking to be a little bit different. Nicole Douglas and the ASU midfield came ready to play tonight. In their home opener, they defeated the University of Texas El Paso 3-1 here at Sun Devil Stadium. Um, I'm, I was really pleased with the midfield. I thought we moved the ball quite well. Sometimes a little bit too safe in our play. I thought we could have looked to play forward a little bit earlier. Um, not, not direct, but you know we have opportunities to turn and, and, and uh, slice open uh, the opposing team a little bit quicker. Uh, but I thought overall they did a great job. The Sun Devils midfield took control of the match early on, allowing them to control the pace of the game. ASU went up three goals to none thanks to two from Nicole Douglas and another from Olivia Nguyen before Texas El Paso scored later on. However, it was too little too late for the Miners. The Sun Devils worked the ball up the field playing out of the back, creating space in the middle of the field and allowing their forwards to find soft spots in the Texas El Paso defense. Ultimately, soccer has a really big midfield battle and at the, at the end of the day, the team that wins that battle is likely to win the game, so I think all credit should go to them. I mean. They did their job. Their job was to outwork their opponents, and they did just that. Olivia Nguyen was a crucial piece of ASU's attack as she and her teammates in the midfield shut down Texas El Paso for the majority of the match. This Sunday, February 7th, the Sun Devils will host New Mexico State back here at Sun Devil Stadium. For Cronkite Sports, I'm Nick Elsner, signing off.